Gemini, welcome to your reading for this week, starting the 24th of March. It's a general reading, so take everything that resonates with you and leave anything else behind. I'm using my teacup tarot and my time to shine oracle decks. So starting off with your reading, we have the Knight of Coins. This is all about planning. Plan A, plan B, and if necessary, plan C. Here we are, look, she's the only knight in the whole deck who isn't riding the motorbike. She's the slowest one because on the card here, look, she's reading the map. But that's wonderful because when she gets back on the bike, she knows exactly where she's going and how to get there. So detailed, careful planning is your overall energy. Your help or your hurdle, the five of pencils, is all about learning from experience. Now on the card, look, she's closed that gate. She's learned. She's been there. She's done that. She's got the T-shirt. And now she's moving forward with new plans, new ideas and new ways forward. This is where this planning is going to come in. What do you need to focus on? Long term plans. We were talking about plans here. The three of wands is about long term planning. It's about abundance. It's about things showing up that you've been hoping for. And it asks you. When you're long term planning, looking at the bigger picture and this abundance is showing up, do the groundwork. So here on the card, look, the long term plan is the healthy forest. But she can't have the healthy forest without planting the seedlings. That's just what you need to do. This is where these new plans and new ideas are coming in. You have to act on those. Take some action. And then you'll be well on your way towards this long term plan. How can you help yourself? We've got the Ace of Coins, something new, brand new beginning, golden opportunity showing up. So the coin suit very much represents home life, family life, financial life and work life. And here on the card, look, she's moving towards this golden opportunity. She's found the keys to the treasure chest. So look out for this new opportunity coming in. Pulling it all together, the Emperor card asks you to step up into this leadership role. The Emperor is one of the major arcana cards. At a moment's notice, the Emperor is ready to go because everything is planned in advance. And here we have this planning energy coming in again. The emperor here, everything has a place, everything in its place and detailed plans are in place and everything is organised. And that's just the energy that you need to be mindful of and to embrace this week. The outcome card, we've got the moon, card 18. Now, this is very much about you going within the answers lie within. That's what it says on this lovely lantern here. So trusting your intuition. What do you know? The moon card also says that there could be new information coming to light that you don't know already. So you really need to pay attention and make sure that you know and you have all the information you need. So detailed planning, stepping up, getting organised, very much you stepping up into this role of organiser, learning from the past, learning from mistakes, learning from experience and moving forward in new ways with new plans and new ideas. And look, she's moving forward and facing this golden opportunity, just like this angel here, look. So looking out for this golden opportunity, making long term plans and remembering to take those first action steps to get you there. If you don't take the steps, nothing is going to happen. So get busy 
do the groundwork and plant these little seeds get busy with those first steps so let's get some clarity from the time to shine deck the eight of emotion is about making your positive move forward towards something good moving forward again she's following the sat nav there and it's programmed for success and happiness your help or your hurdle time to leave behind any old fears anything that's weighing you down or holding you back self-sabotage self-criticism self-doubt any guilt look she's left all those behind here in these shopping bags and walking forward with a bag of confidence over her shoulder and moving forward with optimism and with positivity literally lovely mindfulness for you this week what do you need to focus on the three of thought is trusting that things will get better knowing that this situation will improve it's talking things over taking some time out just to rest and relax and know that this situation will get better it's very much a card of healing and moving on how can you help yourself the ten of emotion is lovely this is the happy ever after card enjoying contented family life and loving and rewarding relationships it's the happy ever after card emotional fulfillment absolutely beautiful pulling it all together the 14 of wisdom this is the temperance card in traditional tarot is about you bringing wonderful ideas together and that's just what she's doing here look she's baking and all these different ideas are going into the bowl to make the cake so compromise discussion talking things over looking at things from all different angles very much a focus on balance and compromise and your final outcome card the eight of thought is a mindfulness card a little reminder again about breaking free from negativity believing in you you cheerleading for you supporting yourself and moving forward towards positive new things now she's got a red balloon here and it's full of negative thoughts and she's just about to pop that with a pin because she's got a new delivery from the self-belief company saying oh yes I can that needs to be your mantra this week so looking at your reading overall planning detailed planning stepping up into that leadership role learning from experience and then moving on towards positivity with new plans and new ideas leaving behind anything that's weighing you down holding you back especially if it's negativity and especially if it's somebody else's know that this situation will improve this is very much a card of healing and moving on making sure that you listen to your intuition and you pay attention because there could be new information coming to light and then here's your opportunity here's this lovely happy ever after card this is you being balanced, being sensible, using compromise, mixing ideas together, leaving behind the old and embracing the new. So I hope you've enjoyed the reading. Thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. Thank you even more for subscribing to my channel and supporting me in that respect. I really appreciate that. Just click that button. It's free. So have a lovely week. Take care of yourselves and I'll see you here again soon.